Hello, kitty designers, and welcome on to this story. My name is Peter, and up to this story, you're just going to see how we can be able to let the customer confirm their order this is uh, on on the account on my account dashboard. When they click on this order button, they have this button now that they can confirm the order once they just uh, get it uh, delivered on their end. With this, when they confirm uh, the order, we have this button now. Uh, this data is here from processing now to completed. This is how it's going to work. You can see my order number is 1380 and I have 1380 here. So what we're just going to do is I need to refresh this page here. With that, now we have this button now and you can see now we can just click this and confirm the order. And once uh, they have completed the order, they have now this button, the view button. They can view the order and they can be able to uh, do all the other things that is needed. So from there, we just go back to our dashboard as the admin or the whoever is, um, whoever is capable of the order. You can see our order now here is that neatly and you can see the status now is processing. But once we refresh it here, the order now just has to be completed. That's the tutorial for today and we're just going to do it and we're just going to do it with a very few simple steps and without, and without further ado, let's just get into action and I'll show you how. The first thing you just need to do, we are just going to head over to the dashboard and on the dashboard menu, we have the button for the plugin. Select a new, we need to add a new button. Uh, we need to add a new plugin that will facilitate for us to be able to add the code. So here we have it. Here we can we search for code snippet. Here we have it. It's from code snippet pro 700,000 7, active installation. We install the plugin and after successful installation, we need to activate the plugin. Then from there, all we just need to do is on on this now, on this end here, you can just click uh, the snippet button or on the dashboard menu, we have now the, uh, the button for the snippet. On over, we have this a new. Let's add our snippet that will add these features. It's just so easy in what we just need to do. The first thing you just need to do is we just give it a name. Say, let's cut my complete order. Just name it the way you just want to name it. So I just want to name it like that. And after that, I have included the link on the description. And all you just need to do is you copy uh, this code here. And all you just need to do is paste it on this end here. And once it's done, all you just need to do is save and activate. With this now, we have added the feature on our e-commerce website. Let me see if I have a pending order here. Ah, I have this 2103 which is on hold and we have the other one which is processing and let's just head over here and we just log in. So from here we head over to orders and you can see now we have the button for to confirm the order number is 2932. Let's see here if you do have it. 2932 here yeah, you can see here is processing and all you just need to do is click confirm on this end here. Once it's done on that end, remember it was this order and we refresh here. It just worked perfect. I hope you did learn something out of this tutorial. And without the tutorial for today, and I hope you did learn something out of this tutorial. If you did learn something out of this tutorial, hit the thumbs up. If you're new here, consider subscribing. Till next time, thank you.